Hello peoples, you with us on Gamma Cup and today we are doing another gun overview. Look at the sexy stats for the CM901. The CM901 of course is the gun we're overviewing. Yes. Now the uh, look at the attachments, the recommended class I suggested and please enjoy the troll face. No, I'm joking. Okay, so we're basically uh, I'll be talking about the CM901, what attachments I like, what attachments I don't like, blah blah blah, blah you know. The old, the old standard bullshit. Playing some domination on Arkadin, as usual it's MW3. And my friends casually spamming me with, you know, requests. What you gonna do? Anyway, so CM901 boys, CM901, CM901, CM901. What type of gun is the CM901? Oh my god, my god, my god, no. Okay, um, yep, I am a tad hypo as usual. So let's just quickly tell you guys what class we're using. Um,. Alright, so we're using the CM901 Sansa. No, alright, CM901 Attachments is the proficiency. Silencer and, um. And. No, 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 no. No. Attach the, the proficiency is impact. Is it? No. Or kick. Yep, the proficiency is kick. Damn me. Um, okay, the proficiency is kick. We're using a silencer on it. Um. We got portable radar, C4, uh, you got yourself Scorpion Akimbo as a secondary, I assume. And halfway down the game, I do pick up a PP90, P90, whatever. But the the important thing is I do actually get uh, a reasonable kill streak, I, I think, personally, with just the same line of one. So, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm happy. But then again, I'm always happy, so screw you. Joking. I love you all. Uh, um, and I'm not gay. Don't worry. Um, so, yeah, guys. Uh, CM901, um, the perks, I'm using my sleight of hand, uh, quick draw, and steady aim. Steady aim did come in use because, you know, I like the spray. Juiced, and, uh, I was using IMS, straight front, and AC130. Do not ask me why I use those skill streaks. I felt like using them. They failed miserably every single damn one. The straight front got me one kill, the AC130 got me two, and the IMS got me, like, I don't know half a kill. It did like did like a hit marker on some guy with a riot shield. I don't even know. Um, doesn't matter. So anyway, let's let's get straight into this boys. CM901. What type of gun is it? Yeah, bro, for shizzle, my dizzle, hizzle, 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 hizzle. hizzle. Okay, no, I cannot rap. Mm, yeah. Okay, going on. So CM901. It's an interesting gun. I got the IMS there. Um, I'm gonna place this. You guys will see the hit marker. Um, anyways, CM901 is an interesting gun. A lot of people don't tend to like it, so let's just look at the stats. Its damage is 49 at close range, 25 at long. Um, the reload time is pretty fast. What was it like? Um, you know, I'm, I'm a genius, aren't I? Just like completely forgetting what's at the start of this video, aren't I? Just like the, the smartest nub scrub. Alright, so its reload time is, um, how much? Like 2.33 seconds. Look, as assault rifles go, that's a pretty mediocre reload time. I, it's 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 actually in the middle. It's perfectly situated in the middle of everything else. The RPM is exceedingly slow at 666. Look, man, if you want to use a gun, the ACR has roughly the same damage and it's like 50 bullets faster. So I have no idea why you wouldn't use that. But look, this is the same 901, and I'm gonna tell you guys why it is useful. And also the ACR is a bit of a scrub nub gun because you don't need skill to use it. But anyway, going on. So and finally, last stat is the raise time. This is interesting about the CM901. Alright, uh, the CM901, the raise time, you got yourself a nice little 0 0.75. That is the fastest apart from the G36 uh raise time. Like that's the fastest in the game. It's on par with the M4A1 and the Scar, a bunch of other shit. But anyway, so those are the stats. Uh recommended class. Let me guys so first I'm gonna like get you guys, tell you guys about this gun, and then I'm going to tell you guys what I think of the personal gun, personal opinion, and how I think you guys should use it. But first, let's let's actually get down to the gritty, nitty, bitty, hitty, pickity, fidgety of the gun. Alright, so the perks I reckon you should use, these are the perks I actually think you should use primarily, like the perks I really recommend. Slide of hand, quick draw, and marksman, in one class, that I recommend using. Um, uh, 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 the proficiency... Look, I don't know. If you want to use impact, impact is fantastic. Kick is also fantastic. Like I know this videos, um, they they say that kick is not. It's it doesn't it doesn't uh, a mediocre difference for this gun. Like yeah, that's true. But it still helps. Quite
quite a fair bit, so I would recommend it. And attachments if you want. So like, if you if you can deal with recoil, then go for attachments. If you if you can't deal with recoil, um, you don't like that fudgery, then yeah, you know, go kick. Uh, but anyway, so I I would I, I would recommend impact or attachments or kick. So I don't know, use whatever you want. Uh, the attachments, silencer, red dot sight, and uh, extended mags. So extended mags is important because you run out of ammo so quickly with this gun. And the thing is, if you put scavenger on, it's interesting. The reload time is low, but it still pisses me off so much. And like I know a lot of people like hesitate. You can't ever be good if you just rely on sleight of hand all the time. And that's true. I really should learn to deal with scavenger, and I can. But it pisses me off so much, like a lot. Like you guys do not understand how much um, it actually enrages me when the guys like. Pulls the gun to the side and like, uh, so annoying. But anyway, yeah. So those are the recommended ones. Uh, if you don't want to use sleight of hand, quick draw marksman, you can use scavenger, assassin, and steady aim. But those are the the perks I really don't recommend you go too far off from because they're they're probably the best ones you're gonna use. Uh, so I have switched to another gun and I'm sorry about that, but you know I ran out of ammo. Eh, eh. I know. What are you gonna go? Eh, not using scavenger. His tight, huh? Eh. Suck my bears. No. But yeah, it was, it was, I should have, I should have accounted for that. Anyway, going on, so let's talk about the gun now. Huh, <sighs> same number of gun, what type of gun is it? As I've told you guys, there's a bunch of different types of guns in this game. Sorry, for the weird talking, I'm chewing gum. Um, uh, you can hear clearly, it sounds like I'm, um, doing something else. Nah, 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 joking. Um, but anyway, as I've told you guys, there is a bunch of different guns in this game. Like, honestly, there is, there is. Like different types of guns, like the um, the G36 is a lockdown gun, the MK14 is a lockdown gun. There's assault guns, there's charge guns, there's defensive guns, there's uh, campy guns even. Although even though I said there isn't, um, they shouldn't be campy guns, but the, like they they can be used as campy guns, and when they are, they're really useful. <laughs> but anyway, so the, what type of gun is the CM901? Now the CM901 gun is a mix it's a mix between assault so charge out there and also defensive so by defensive I mean always taking cover and defending and lockdown I mean like literally securing an area not moving from that area so you know that area like the back of your hand you don't necessarily have to have cover all the time but you like with defensive you pretty much need cover all the time but lockdown is sort of just like you have this area Wherever they come from, you're going to take them down because you have that gun and it's good for this. But anyway, so CM901, it's a fantastic uh, assault slash defensive gun. Because the thing is, this is the best, best way you can possibly think of this gun. The CM901 is a more accurate version of the AK-47. Every time you're wondering, should I charge in there? Think about what you would do if you had an AK. Just think about that. Just think about that and you will make the right choice. That's a promise. Every time using the CM901, just think, this is, pretend this is an AK, what would I actually do? Would I charge in there? I'm pretty sure I would. So then you charge in there, use shape fire if you want. You, you rate them up in the bum hole. But, with the AK, you can't, you can't always take people out at ranges exceedingly well. With this gun, it's easy shit. Like, I'm not even joking. It is easy shit. So yeah, try, just think of the CM901 gun like that. So you guys, um... The class, I've told you guys, the class I recommend using um, I, it is an AK. Think about it like that. Think about it as in you can run into the enemy, but you can also stay from an, a distance and pick them off. It's not as accurate as you're going to get, but it's pretty damn, pretty damn accurate. So you guys think it just, every time you're using this, every time you're using this gun, think of it like an AK. Uh, so this is Hesitate Boys. Have a fan freaking tastic day. Use this gun. Try it out at least. And this is Hesitate, and I am signing out. See ya, boys.